Welcome ladies and gentlemen, this is your CNC HD and we are back to the Tank General in a Zero Hour 1.4 patch. Last time we defeated the Super Weapon General and now we are going to defeat, um, let's see, General Kwai the Laser General. Versus General Towns. I calculate that you will lose this battle, General. Good calculator, calculated general tones. Um, actually, I have no I no idea how to defeat this general. Really, no idea. General, our opponent has a stronghold in the middle of the city. His laser defense system is devastating, but requires lots of power. He will be forced to divert his power to one point of defense at a time. Use this to your advantage. There you go, General. I've drawn the line in the sand. Now I dare you to cross it. Come what and get you? me, General. <laughs> okay, um, how do you defeat an enemy who is bunkered in as hell? Um, I have no idea. So I'm not going to try a few tactics here. Um, and then I am going to see if it works or if it not works. Okay, first I sent my second dozer here to the left. You can do those waypoints with holding the alt button um, and then sending your dozer there to the spot where you want it to. Um, the second dozer, uh, the next dozer I'm also sending here to the right and with the next dozer I'm going to build a supply center here. I don't need the command center. This is the most asked question ever. Why do you sell your command center? Because of the 1000 extra cash. Let's 1000 extra cash is very important in the beginning. You can build extra units, extra buildings and yeah, you don't need your command center at the beginning if you can play without a radar, of course. If you cannot play without a radar, um, if you need a radar, then uh, upgrade the radar and don't sell your command center. What is my dozer doing? Building a barracks will only get your men hurt, General. He is doing shit. Completely shit. Okay, war factory on the in the production. Oh the rangers are chasing my dozer. Four of them, this is not good. They're doing so much damage here. If you play against a computer enemy, the units are always doing more damage. Because the script is um, a script is making those units more powerful. Okay. With the war factory, I'm going to train. Uh, I'm going to build a dragon tank, and with the dragon tank, I can clear all those captured buildings. This is very important, so I can get promoted more faster. And getting promoted more faster means beating this challenge more faster. Okay, the first building is captured. Um, with those I'm going to overrun those rangers. Should be the easiest way to get rid of them. And let's let's go. Perfect. Okay, so now I need Gatling tanks here against all those Comanches. Comanches love to attack there on the right side. You really need air defense here on the right side. It's very, very important. Dragon tank clearing the first buildings, getting me promoted. Next Gatling tank here to the right. Oh, let's send it here to this spot. And also another getting tanked here to this spot. Can't have enough getting tanks there on the side. Everything ready here. There's the next building, but I'm going to clean it here over this direction. Because I don't want to drive here over this direction because the laser turrets could shoot on me. If they are doing it, I'm not sure, but they could do it. Um, okay, so this is enough here. 
Uh, now I'm going to upgrade the chain gun upgrade. Very important against Comanches. I'm destroying the buildings because then I have a better range here on incoming units. I can shoot them down more faster and yeah, I only need one building so I'm destroying the rest of them. My dragon tank enjoying is enjoying his life here. And also the gapping tanks. Second nuclear reactor here on the right side and his particle can is ready to shoot in 15 seconds. But he will not shoot it uh, right away. He will wait a few seconds and then shoot with it. With the uh, second building we're going to get uh, there is in this building here. You only need those two buildings. You don't need the rest of them. So just destroy the rest of the buildings. It's the best choice. Okay, the particle can is ready. He's going to shoot it at the base defense or something like this. So build a few buildings there and they will find out what is uh, what he is targeting at first. I assume it's the Gatling um, turret. And it was the War Factory. So the first target is the War Factory. This is something we need to memorize. Uh, here was the first Comanche attack. Okay, the second attack is always going on the command center. The only thing we need to build is a command center scaffold. Uh, my drain tank is still here. That's good. Let's save it here where the getting tanks are. Okay, so I'm building a command center scaffold right here. And also building up a little force and the second dragon tank. Now you can see the the buildings are gone, and now I can shoot those laser tanks more faster and more efficient. Okay, there is the second particle cannon. Okay, um, maybe the outlawder, um, no, nationalism. What I need to do is building a propaganda tower here because those Gatling tanks will not last forever. But they will last forever when I build, if I build a um, propaganda tower there. Okay, let's see what he's shooting at with the third particle can. Giving him a few targets. And he is shooting at the barracks. So first one war factory, second one command center, third one barracks. Okay, this is all we need to know. Now we are safe against those particle cannons. Okay, those rangers have no chance at all. can also rebuild my command center any second. And two star promoted. Yeah, let's let's build a command center. Okay, I'm also sending a few Gatling tanks here to the right because Comanches love to get to my base over this direction and like I said there's the first Comanche like I predicted okay, maybe I can find a few more buildings here to clear with my dragon tank and there's the next building to clear I have 22,000 but I will need this cash um, to fill up a lot of helixes so my plan is to attack him from one side with tanks and then um, get into his base with helixes over the second side. The plan is he can only power one defense at a time so I'm going to attack this one side with tanks and then take over the other side which is not powered with helixes. I'm not sure I'm not sure if it's going to work. I doubt it 
but um, let's see uh, let's think about it uh, about it positive okay my units are all doing a great job here propaganda tower also going to need a lot of tank hunters Congratulations, General. You have been promoted. Ah, perfect. And there's the first artillery strike I'm going to need this morning. Um, Building an airfield only provides airborne targets for my lasers, General. Okay, I'm building two airfields to be able to build more helixes. This first attack has to work, otherwise I'm running out of cash and then I have to rely on hackers, which I don't want to do because hackers are not so efficient. Okay, first one war factory, so let's give him a war factory here. Ah, oh, he's shooting at the airfield. What an asshole. Ah, oh, fuck. So the first one is going on an airfield. So maybe he changed his mind. What an ass. Okay, the thing with the helixes is, if you send five tank hunters with the nationalism into the helix, they will keep the nationalism. So always send five at a time into the helix. This way you can keep the strong power, the strong advantage of nationalism. Filling up more and more helixes. If those helixes get through, then his base will be gone. Uh, more barracks. Okay, so those helixes are full. There's a second, uh, the third party can. It's going to shoot on the barracks, so let's give him a barracks. I hope he didn't change his mind um, the second time. Uh, and uh, third barracks. And he's shooting again on the airfield, so. He really likes my airfield. But it's only 1000 so I can live with this. I can totally live with this fact. Okay, I need now a getting tank here on the top side. Getting tank to defeat all those rangers because my building has no chance against rangers. This is the disadvantage of um, tank hunter bunkered uh, tank hunters bunkered uh, buildings here. Okay, good. Now I need to repair this building. Very important. Okay, fold up. Uh, so you have a Comanche. Towns tries to be funny again. <laughs> okay, uh, filling up the next helix. I really need a lot of helixes because 
10 or 11 of them will go down when I try to get through here. I'm very sure of it. Um, I never tried it out, so let's see if Helixes can get through. I only tested it with Chinox, and Chinox can get through very easy. So I'm curious to see how it works with Helixes. Okay, I'm running out of money. And yeah, okay, now I need. Uh, now I need hackers. Otherwise, I cannot continue if my helixes fail. So, I really need hackers now. And I need to save money to have something against those particle cans. Okay, and those will have propaganda towers to heal my helixes. Okay, I know he's shooting at the airfields. This is what I need to keep in mind. Um, where's my dragon tank? Do I have my dragon tank? Maybe I can. Maybe I can get a five star promoted, and I can use my EMP bomb to um, shut down a block here. Would be very efficient. He's ready to shoot, so let's give him a scaffold of an airfield. Ah, more rangers, thank you. So kind of you. Okay. Now I will build tanks. I'm about to attack. Okay, it's worked. Um, I'm building tanks now to attack him on one flank to attract the attention there. Good. Ah, and he shoots down my Trang tank. Not very nice of him. There goes my free star promoted dragon tank, so I need to build another one. Uh, fuck, now I have enough. I don't have enough cash now to build up my command center. Ah, okay, let's just do it this way. So here's the command center scaffold towns. Do what you want. Just do it. Oh, okay, the third one is going on the airfield. <coughs> okay, let's mix some red guards into the group here. This should last longer here when I attack. Oh, and I also need to build another airfield, of course. And we finished off another dragon tank. Yes. Oh, this is not Oh! Oh! Ah, oh, no! I didn't know he's shooting on units! This is new to me. Okay, I think I can sell this building here. Don't need this anymore. And I can also sell this building here. I also don't need this anymore. And the only thing I need now is units to attack the flank. Uh, maybe a few more red guards. Red guards are perfect. 
Helix on the sea. Okay, those helixes are ready. Should also upgrade the supplemental messaging upgrade so they can heal faster. Okay, and now I need to save my money because of the particle cannons. Okay, now I'm ready to attack. My helix is getting into position, shooting you with the artillery on this block. He's powering the left side. I'm getting through here on the right side. I'm curious to see how it works. If it doesn't work, I have a really big problem, to be honest, because if those helixes fall down to the ground, I have nothing to hold against them. It's a good thing that the Avenger uh, got destroyed, because now my helixes can get through. You've tripped our outer perimeter warning laser, General. We know you're there now. Okay. He is distracted. Now I need to use this moment. And it seems to work. The only problem here is this building. Oh. Hope my helixes don't shoot on the Comanches. And it looks good, I can get through a few helixes survive. And oh, this is close. Oh. Very close. Oh. Oh, and an Avenger shoots down two of my helixes. Nice. Okay, now I need to be very careful. If those helixes survive. Then I have a chance here. Okay. Finishing off all the particle cannons. Oh, this looks good. I hope he doesn't send the Avenger here to the side, otherwise I will lose all my helixes. But there's a trick if I use the emergency repair here. I can repair my helixes and boom! ARC. Little healed. Only a little. Okay, I can use those rangers to heal up my helixes. Maybe it works. It'd be perfect. Oh, he's attacking me with so many rangers now. I really need to watch it that my helixes are surviving. And then I need to finish off those war factories very fast. Or maybe just shooting down the power. We also good. Okay, uh, maybe a bomber. And hmm. Yeah, let's go with the tank. Tank drop. He seems like he's only attacking with, with rangers now, which is pretty funny. <laughs> I need to be careful that I'm not coming too close to the building. My helix is uh, flying like retards right now. And it's working, perfect. So the first war factory is gone. Also, those uh, Chinooks can be very difficult because helixes love to shoot on Chinooks while they are standing in them. This shoots the helix down. 
on its own. Okay, command center is gone. Dozers are gone. He cannot rebuild his buildings now. Only thing I need to do is now survive and finish off all his buildings and then I have won this challenge. This would be perfect with three highly damaged um, helixes. I'm a bit afraid here of the last buildings because those uh, buildings here, those garrison buildings are not to be underestimated. If I come too close I will lose my helix. I will finish off this one with a bomber. He still has power. Oh, I'm coming very close to those buildings. Okay, looks good, looks good. Those buildings are all gone. Oh, perfect. Now I only need to finish off eight buildings and then I'm finished here. Okay, only five buildings left. Oh no, there's the Avenger! Oh, lost another helix. That's a problem if you attack the buildings here on the side. Oh, nice! I managed it to beat with only helixes. This is perfect, but like you could see, uh, like you was a were able to see, helixes are not the fastest unit. You defeated me, General, but I will scan your tactics and devise a superior strategy. Whew, this worked better like expected. And yeah, it worked. Perfect. So this is a way to beat the laser general without super weapons and with helixes. It also worked to attack on the one side to distract the laser turrets and then attack on the other side with helixes. It worked better than expected. Okay, so this was your CNC HD um, in another challenge video. Um, you can find more videos well sorted on my website cnchd.weebly.com Link is always in the description below and like always I thank you for watching this is your CNCHD and peace out